guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I got a great one for you. We are gonna do a cardio kickboxing routine and we are gonna be using weights. But if you don't have any weights, you can grab anything you have around the house or wherever you are. You can use like water bottles, can of soup, whatever you have. Or you can also do this without weights. No need for it if you don't have any. All right, let's get going. What we're gonna do first is we're going to engage our abs and how we're going to do that is our arms are going to go up like this and we're going to bring them in nice and tight our stomachs are going to go in and our hips are going to go slightly forward to protect that spine the hip and the lower back and that core all right so bring them in you're going to have your weights right like this palms facing each other what i'm going to have you do is you're going to lift up on your uh, toes and you're going to punch forward right like this so the hand that is punching forward is the heel that is coming up right there alternating sides elbows are nice and tight in that body nice so i can feel my elbows close to my rib cage i'm just going punching forward lifting up side to side nice good job guys Keep it going. We're going to do 10 more right now. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Nice. Now from here, we engage those abs again. We're going to pivot to the side and you're going to punch out. And you're going to bring it back in. You're going to pivot to this side and punch out. So we are going to be alternating sides. Make sure to pivot and make sure to move that hip when you're going to the sides. All right, you guys ready? And here we go. Punch it. Punch. Side to side. Bringing that weight in nice and tight. Make sure to move your body to the side, right here. And again, at any time, if it gets too much to be using these weights, make sure to just put them down and you can just start again. Nice, keep it going. All right, we're gonna do 10 more. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Set your arms down right like this. Open up your legs a little bit more for me. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go down into a squat and you're gonna punch it up and you're gonna punch it down while we are squatting. So I'm gonna punch up right now and then when I squat down, I'm gonna go on this side and then we're gonna go over here. So we're gonna alternate sides. So when you're standing, Punch up on an angle, and then when you squat down, punch down low. So up, low, up, low. Nice. Alternating sides, taking your time. Make sure when you squat, your butt goes back. Pretend that you're sitting in a toddler's chair. So go down nice and low. Chest up, so you're not using your back. Nice. Good job, guys. Keep it going. Awesome. Up and down with those legs, bending the knees. And again, if this gets too tiring or too hard, just ditch the weights and do it without. Nice, we've got 10 more. 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome job. All right, bring your feet in just a little bit more. Just a little bit. Toes are going to be forward. We're going to do uppercuts with the weight in hand. Again, you don't have to use the weights, or if you have a water bottle, that will work just as good. We are going to be alternating. Now, what we're going to do is all our power is going to come from this leg. We're going to come right like this. We're going to pivot our body. So our knees are going to come up. Our up, heels are going to come up. Our knees are going to go inward. We're going to bring our arms down here and then pop it out and then right back in this position. 
So it's gonna go in, pop it out, and then right here. All right, you guys, you ready? Engage those abs again, and here we go. One, two, that's it. We're just pivoting each side. Now when we do an uppercut, turning that wrist, so it's up in the air, right like this, alternating sides, stomachs in nice and tight, alternating, boom, awesome. Punch it out. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Awesome job, guys. Ooh, I am feeling my arms. I don't know about you, and I certainly am. All right, guys, let's add a knee and a kick. I'm going to back up so you guys can see me a little bit better. Okay, so you're gonna have your weights together, right, like this, holding them. So they are gonna to touch one another. What you're gonna do is you're gonna bring up your knee, you're gonna twist over it, down, and then a side kick, right, like that. Then we're gonna twist, down, side kick. We are gonna alternate sides. All right, you guys ready? Stomach's gonna be nice and tight. Engage those abs, I'm gonna fix my weights. You guys ready? Knee, twist, kick, other side. Knee twist, kick. Knee, kick. Knee, kick. Nice. Knee, kick. Knee, kick. Awesome. Keeping that torso up. So I'm making sure to bring my knee to my body and not the other way around. My spine is straight. Torso is nice and tall. Stomach's in tight. All right, we got 10 more. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one, and one. Nice job, guys. All right, we're just gonna punch it on an angle right like this really quick you're not really you're just pivoting just a little right here but i really want it in the waist area all right so we're not lifting up the heels you're going to want to but keep them down all right you guys you ready here we go punch it side to side right there nice and quick punch 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 awesome keep it going 10 more, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Woo, great job guys. Go get some water, I'm gonna grab mine. By the way, look at this awesome, cool water bottle. It's so cool, it looks like a weight. All right, you guys, let's go again. All right, we're gonna go right back here. We're gonna start from the beginning. Um, remember, the beginning was when we lifted up on our heels, alternating, and we just punch forward, okay? Again, you don't have to use weights, okay? This is what it looked like without weights. You guys ready? Everybody join me. Ready and go. Up, up, right like this. It works just as good. You don't have to have those weights in your arms. I'm gonna give you a modification this round. Awesome. If you're using those weights and I'm going too fast, go right here. Because when you do have the weights in your hand, you do want to slow it down a little bit. But if you don't have weights, you're right here. A little bit quicker. Nice. All right, you guys, we got 10 more. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, and one. Awesome. Again, you do have your weights. If you want them, I'm just doing modification this round. All right, we're going side to side. So we're pivoting. Remember, we're going to turn to the side, punch. Turn to the side and punch. All right, engage those abs. Ready and go. Punch, punch. Nice. Side to side. Turn that whole body. Stomach's in tight. Get that heel up, pivot that hip. So your hip should face me. Nice, punch it out. 
And again, when you're holding weight, it does go slower. You're usually right at this pace, okay? So don't go at the pace I am if you have those weights in your hand. A little bit faster if you don't. All right, 10 more. Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Awesome job, guys. All right. Again, with weights, you guys are going to go slower. Without weights, follow me. All right. Engage those abs nice and tight. We're going up. We're going down into those squats. Ready? Here we go. Punch up. Punch down. Punch up. Punch down. We're alternating sides. All right. So without weights, here we are. See the difference? Nice. Now, if you do have weights, remember, you guys are a lot slower. Perfect. Good job. Up and down. Remember, butt's back, chest is up. So your chest stays up when you go down into that squat. So I'm not leaning forward. Awesome. All right, we got five more. Five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome. All right, let's connect those weights together. If you have weights, if not, Follow me, we're just still putting our hands together as such. We're gonna go over, we're still bringing up that knee and twisting, and we're kicking out. All right, actually, I'm gonna move my weights a little bit forward so I don't accidentally trip over them. All right, you guys ready? Let's engage those abs. Again, people with weights, go slower. People without weights, follow me. Here we go, knee, side kick, knee, side kick, and remember, we are alternating. Boom. Nice. Side to side. Keeping our torso up nice and tall. Our spine straight. Stomachs are in tight. And keep it going. Nice. Ten more. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five, four, three, two, last one, and one. Nice. Last one we're going to do, toes are forward, bring them in just a little bit closer. And we're punching on an angle, so we're just moving our top part, really engaging those abs and working those abs while we do it. So engage them, here we go, punch, side to side. Now without weights, I want you to go as fast as you can. Right there. Nice. Twisting that waist. All right, so I'm not twisting my hips. Twisting from the waist part, side to side. You have weights, you're a little bit slower right here, but you're still going at a good pace. Nice. Good job, guys. Keep it going. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Awesome job, guys. Woo. Finish round two. Get another drink. Let's look at the time here. Woo. We're doing some really good time now. We have round three coming up. All right. I'm going to do round three again with the weights. Um, again, if you don't have weights, that's okay. Just remember that pace. You guys are going faster. If you do have weights, you can pick them up. All right, we're starting from the beginning. Remember, we're lifting up that heel and we're punching forward. Engaging those abs, and here we go. Lift up and punch. Side to side, nice. Palms face each other and then goes down. So when you punch out, that palm faces the ground. Lifting up on those toes, working that calf muscle side to side. Perfect. All right, we got 10 more right now, 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. We're gonna go side to side punches. Engage those abs, here we go. Turn, punch, punch, punch. Remember, you're lifting up on that heel, pivoting that body, punching side to side. And I just realized we forgot those uppercuts. Round two. That's all right, I'll remember them this time. 
Nice job, guys. Keep it going. Pivot. Awesome. Ten more. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Nice job, guys. All right. We're doing those. We're going to go up high. And we're going to squat and go down low. We're going to alternate sides. All right, you guys. You ready? Here we go. Punch it up. Punch it down. Punch it up. Punch it down. Awesome. Engaging those abs. Keeping that back up nice and tall. Now remember, if you don't have weights, I want you guys to go faster. Up and down. Nice. But with weights, let's be safe and go nice and slow. Awesome. Good job, guys. Keeping that chest up, you should be able to see me when you go down into that squat. All right, 10 more, here we go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, last two. Nice, last one. Awesome, okay, I'm gonna drop my waist because we're gonna do the uppercuts and I wanna show you guys for those of you who don't have weights, how that's going to look. So I'm going to drop mine for this time. Um, if you don't have weights, follow my pace. If you do, make sure you slow it down. Gauge those abs for me, guys. We're going to go in and we're going to pop it up, doing upper parts. Ready and go. So if you don't have weights, this is where you're at. This is your pace. Nice and quick. Abs are tight. Popping it out. Pivoting on that foot, side to side. Nice. Keep it going. If you do have weights, you're here. Nice and slow. Controlling that movement. Staying safe. No injuries. Nice. All right, let's do 10 more. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two and one. Woo! Nice job, guys. All right, I'm gonna back up my weights. We're gonna do the knee to the side kick. All right, so we're gonna grab these. We're gonna engage our abs nice and tight. Have those weights together. Don't let go of them. You guys ready? Here we go. Knee, side kick, reverse. Knee, side kick, not reverse. Huh. Other side. Nice, good job. Twist it, kick it. Twist it, kick it. Remember that torso is staying up nice and tall. Keeping that spine straight. Awesome. My foot is in a flex position while I'm kicking. All right, you guys, we have 10 more. 10, nine, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one, one. Woo, nice job. All right, get those feet back in position. Toes are forward, hips are stable, hips are going to go forward. We're going to engage those abs. Stomachs are nice and tight. We're going on an angle. Remember, we're not moving our hips, we're moving our waistline. Ready and go. Punch it. Side to side at a good pace. Nice. For those of you who don't have weights in your hand, double time it. Go super quick. Nice. Punch it. Punch it. Great job. Ten more. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, and one. Woo! Nice job, guys. All right, get your last water break. We're gonna start cooling down and stretching out. So get your drink. And my weight's like right under me. I do not want to trip. All right, you guys, great job. All right, let's work our abs a little bit. So let's come down to the ground. Keep your weights 
um, nearby. I am gonna move this, sorry guys. Hopefully. Oh, that's too annoying. All right, we're gonna come down to the ground. I'm gonna go at an angle so you guys can see me a little bit better. Have your weights with you if you want. Now, if you don't, this is our movement. We're gonna go back, we're gonna punch forward. Back, punch forward. Now, if you have back pain, I highly suggest you do not use weights, okay? Do not use the weights for this one, all right? If you don't, it's not a problem. You punch forward, you go back. Punch forward, and you go back. Now, I actually do have back problems, so I am not going to use my weights, but I did want, for those of you who have weights, to see what it would look like. All right, you guys, heels are down. Toes are in a flexed position. Your knees are going to be bent. I'm on my tailbone here. And what I'm going to do is my hands are together, my stomach's in nice and tight. I'm going to lean back just a little bit, and I'm going to come back, punch forward. Come back, punch forward. Keeping those heels into the ground. Nice. Keep it going. Back, forward. All right, we have five more. Five, four, three, two, and one. Nice job, guys. All right, now I want you to have your hands here. I want you to scoop them back underneath your butt area, lower back and butt. Feet, oh, feet are going to be straight in the neck. Flex position again. You're just going to lift up the knee into you and then raise it. So knee, raise. Knee, raise. Knee, raise it. Good. Now, when I do the knee into the raise, I am not touching the floor. So it goes knee, floats, and then it goes up. Bring in the knee, float, bring it up. Nice, good job, guys. Keep it going, we're gonna do five more here. Five, four, three, two, we have one more, and one. Great job, guys. All right, grab your weights. If you can, all right, weights are going to be in your hand. Your knees are going to be in a bent position. Feet are flat on the floor. You're going to go over your head. You're going to come up, widen out your arms, touch that ground, crunch up so my shoulder blades are up off the floor, and then right back down. Overhead, widen. So when you go overhead, my weights are together, and then up, out wide. Together, up, out wide. Chin up, pushing your belly button into that floor. When you come up, picture your lower back being pushed in. Nice. Keep it going overhead here. Five more. That's five. Four. Three. Last one, and one, nice job. All right, set those weights aside. Hands behind the head. What we're gonna do is we're gonna alternate bringing in that knee, and we're gonna come up. Now, I don't want you to twist towards the knee, okay? I want you to just go straight up, bringing that knee in, we're gonna alternate. So that's two, three, four. Don't twist, just go straight up. My feet are just in a relaxed position. Nice job, guys. Keep it going. Up. All right, we have five more. Here we go. Five. Four. Three. Two. Last one. And one. Awesome job, guys. All right. You did great. Now, for the nice part, the stretching. All right, I'm gonna move my weights aside. All right, I want you guys to sit up nice and tall, just like I am, one leg behind you, if you can, one leg in front of you, if you are able to. All right, my hand, the opposite hand of my knee, which is my left, so my front knee is in front. I'm gonna cross over, and then my left one's gonna cross over here. Angle and boom. Nice job, guys. Pull it out. 
Great. And relax. Now, I want you to turn at the outside of this knee. Turn right here. And then with your chest up, I want you to push forward. So don't go down. You're just going forward and hold. Great. All right. Switch your legs if you can. So now my right leg is going behind me and my left leg is in front. I'm going to cross my right hand over my left and up with my other crossing over, pretending somebody is pulling both my hands. Hold, hold, hold. And release. Great. Now we're going to go on this side of our knees. With our chest, we're going to go up and out, right like that, and hold. Great. And out. Nice job, guys. All right. We're going to go on all fours. Go on all fours for me. Okay. Right here, we're going to sit back on our heels. And I want you to elongate your arms like I'm pulling them. And drop your head down and just breathe. Nice. Slowly go forward, dropping the hips into the ground, looking up if you can. Great, back to all fours. We're going to needle thread, so I want this knee to go up on an angle. This one's going to go down by that knee, and you're going to put your head all the way down to where your ear touches the floor, and stretch. Nice. Slowly come out of that, and we're going to sit back on our heels again. Arms are straight, head goes down, and hold. Slowly moving forward, dropping those hips to the ground, and up. Good. Up on all fours again. We're going to need a thread, but to the other way now. So this hand is going to go on an angle. This hand is going to go down by that opposite knee. Go all the way down, turning that head, getting that ear down. And I want you to pretend I'm pulling both of your arms. And slowly come up. Nice. All right, let's go on our backs. Have your knees bent. Cross over one leg over the other. I want you to scoop through. Grab that leg. So the leg that was down on the floor is the one you're grabbing, not the one that's up above. Put your head down to the ground and pull it in. Nice. Good job, guys. Now release that leg, but keep your legs the way they are. Have your hands out on the side like a T, and I want you to just fold over towards the foot part, keeping your chest up. So all I did was tilt my legs over to the side. Nice, slowly bring the legs back up. Now we're gonna go the other way. My knees are gonna go down, right like that. Chest stays up, arms out. Perfect. Come back and let's switch sides. This one's going to cross over now. Now we're scooping in that leg that was down. Scoop it in and bring it towards you. Keeping your head down on the ground. Nice. Release your legs, but keep them that way. Hands down like a T. Drop over, foot side first, chest up, and hold. I love this stretch, it helps me so much. Come on up, and other side. Drop down to the knee side, and hold. Nice. And then come up. Now I want you to straighten your body, arms go overhead, feet are straight, and I want you to pretend I'm pulling 
Like I'm pulling your legs and I'm pulling your arms at the same time. Nice. Now bring your knees in to your chest. Hold under there, Bill. Don't hold on top. And bring them in. Nice. And release. All right, let's all come up to a standing position. Nice and slow. Take your time. Oh, I forgot. Fix my camera. Excuse me. Oh, sorry, guys. Sorry for that. All right. Now let's do the upper body. Crossover. Give me a high five. You guys did amazing. Great job today, as always. Slowly go down to your wrist. Give it an extra pull. Then I want you to tilt your head the opposite way of your hands and breathe. Nice. All right. Come slowly out of that. And then let's do the other one. Cross that over by that elbow. Give me another high five. You deserve it. Slowly go down. Wrist right here. Pull it in. Now tilt that head the opposite of your hands. Nice. Both hands go behind you. Pull them down. I want your shoulders back, head back, chest out, and hold. Now if you have a bad neck like me, just look forward and still hold down on the front like that. It's still a great stretch for us. Release, and now bring your arms in front. Stomach goes in, upper back is being stretched. Drop that head. Nice, and release. Awesome job, guys. We're gonna end with our breathing. Just a reminder, we're gonna inhale nice and long through our nose while raising our hands up. We're gonna hold up here, and then we're gonna long exhale out of our mouth, bringing our arms down. All right, here we go. Inhale. Hold, exhale. Inhale, hold, exhale. Nice, inhale, hold, exhale. Awesome job, guys. Thanks again. I hope this was a good one. Don't forget to click that like button. It does help me tremendously. I would truly appreciate it. And if you haven't subscribed and you want to work out with me some more, hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell icon so you're notified when I um, upload a new video workouts. And again, peace out from Illinois.